We have to do this urgent update, everybody. Why? Because we have a new low for AMC right there around the market open exactly. And the price went around the $3.98, the new low for AMC for this month. And why this happened on the market open? This is the main question here. We have a huge wick here, then a huge wick there. And I think this happened at the same time. Yes, on Monday. Today, we have a huge bot bought here or sold here and a huge bot just bought there. This is not normal, guys. We have two wicks at the same time. One test for a new high, one test for a new low at the same day. We have to discuss after that GameStop, guys. The good thing about GameStop is holding the bottom support around the 1350 and we get in near a breakout zone as we discussed the last time around the 1550, uh, 1515. So in today's video, we have to discuss why the volatility, the volume for GameStop is really low and why we have that reaction for GameStop, guys. Why? This is the main question right now that we should discuss and we have to discuss where the price will reverse for AMC, the first signal, of course, for AMC to have the first signal for squeeze. Yes, now you'll be angry right now. You tell me, Jesus, stop saying squeeze. The price not squeezing, continue to go down. Why are you covering AMC and GameStop? The reason is there is always a chance for a squeeze. It happened before so many times. So we don't want to miss any opportunity for a squeeze. Because the squeeze will happen as long as the stock is still trading on the Nasdaq. So AMC is not delisted. So there's still a chance for a squeeze up. That's why we have to discuss in today's video the first signal that we're going to have a squeeze up. Let's dive right in and talk about both of them. But before, hit the like button on the way in. Don't forget. And hit the notification because... Every day we go live on our YouTube channel and before that on our Discord and Patreon. So if you want to join early to know the exact price value for many stocks that have FDA approval, some stocks that have major merger, you can join us on our Patreon and Discord to discuss those entries on. And of course, after that, you can join us on our YouTube channel 30 minutes before the market open. So let's dive deeper and discuss, guys, AMC first. Look at that. As we said in the beginning of the video, we have unusual behavior for today. A week here before the market open and the pre-market open, and a week here around the market open for AMC that make a new low for AMC. The good thing is the price didn't go below you know why because we have a bot guys is this is not a human being who bought amc here i think there's a bot here and the order for the bot buy amc if it dropped below the four dollar that's why we have a, a huge wick on the market open and the price went up so this is a good thing the not good thing is we have a huge wick here and the price went down. So this is, was the first signal that the price went down for a new low for AMC by a huge seller. It uh, just entered the market, yes, on the pre-market open. This is really crazy, guys. Pre-market open, we have a huge seller, and on the market open, we have a good buyer, big buyer. So this is the reaction that we have to watch out for for AMC because now we have a lowered resistance on our big buy, uh, seller around the $4.26. So for tomorrow, guys, we have to watch out for this reaction because today the volume is really low and there's no reaction. First level that we have to watch out for is the $4.26 because after we break this level, we're going to have a nice pump up. Let me just check how much we can do. If we jumped from this level, we can jump at least uh, 12 or 10 percent. Yeah, this is not big deal for AMC because AMC have to jump until the six dollars to have the first signal for squeeze. So this level that we have to break first around the four dollar twenty six. But for my opinion, this is just the first signal. So I will 
put it there. This is better. $4.80. So the $4.80 is the level that we have to break to give us a good jump because 10% is, is nothing for AMC. Yes, this one is better, 25%. So look at this, guys. The $4.80, that's, that's, that's the price that we have to watch out for to have a good reaction because lately we didn't have any good jump for AMC. We didn't have, look at that. This jump, how much? Yes, 10%, 12%. Again, here, how much for this jump? 5% again. How much for this accumulation? Nothing, 15%. So you see the, the pattern here. Since, uh, yes, uh, this month we don't have any buying pressure. We have just selling pressure. So that's why we have to watch out for the $4.80 for the first signal for a major pump, at least over 20% for AMC for the first time. So the $4.80 will give us the first signal that we're going to confirm that we start to reverse at least from the $4 and going toward the most important level for the next month, for my opinion, around the $6. So the $6 will be a really great level to test uh, to have a really good jump of 25% for AMC. Now, if we go to GameStop, GameStop is still looking good for my opinion, guys, because we're still holding the support that we discussed back after we had the the earnings for AMC, even though we have a good earnings, but we have bad revenue, the price didn't uh, have that good reaction. But yeah, we, uh, we have a bit of a uh, uh, pullback after the earnings. After that, we have a really good jump for GameStop after the earnings, 35%. So now I'm watching for the first signal for a squeeze the same for GameStop is around the 1515. So after we break the 1515 and hold the 1350, we might have a really good jump. The same percentage, guys, the same percentage that it might happen for AMC, it might happen for GameStop, which is around the 25, 30%. This is the level that we should have for both. GameStop and AMC to confirm that we started to squeeze and GameStop will have a better reaction because if we pumped 30%, this is make the short cover around this box, we might have a bit of pullback, then we squeeze really high for GameStop. So now just put alert around the 1515 because this is will give us the first signal for a squeeze for GameStop and give us at least the 25% or the 30% that we're waiting for to give us a, at least a, like a, a sign of breather uh, or uh, the signal that we're still alive for both of them, okay? Remember, tomorrow we're gonna do live streaming for both AMC and GameStop and mini stocks, not just AMC and GameStop. And uh, before that, we're gonna do it on, games, uh, on our Discord and Patreon, so join us in the link in comment section below if you want to enter early for mini stocks that have FDA approval and mergers and uh, know where you exit with your profit. This is the most important thing in trading. Thank you for watching, everybody, and see you in the next update.